Welcome to day one, part two. The sun is going down, so we have to make up some time on this hike. We came across another stream that was a little challenging to cross. Kylie and Miguel opted for the no shoes, but I made it fine with mine. Scaled some granite, defeated some incline, and before you knew it, we made it to Lower Lake. Seriously though, although it looks great on camera, the camera still does not do it justice. I mean, this is just insane. Keep in mind how big it is too, because later in the video, when you see it from our campsite, it looks tiny. We still had a bit to hike since we're camping at the upper lake. This right here, this is still the lower lake, which is just so grand that I had to include it in the video. I mean, this, look at it, it's just too beautiful. Shortly after we arrived at the upper lake and found a spot to camp, from start to finish the hike totaled 10 and a half miles with 2,760 feet of elevation gain. This is the upper lake from the water level. And this is the lower lake, and look how small it looks from this vantage point. This is me setting up my tent. We had a view of the lower and the upper lake from our campsite. After we got ready for dinner, set up the stove, boiled some water, and this time we're having pad thai. We chilled, had some laughs, and before you knew it, it started to get dark. I went in my tent, set up my lamp, blew up my mattress pad, set up my sleeping bag, inflated my pillow, got in my sleeping bag liner, got my cable ready for any bears that want to squabble, and just like that, it was time for bed. Stay tuned for the next part because it keeps getting better and better. Thanks for watching and I'll see y'all tomorrow.